Speaker, many things over my political career, I don't find myself I'm that far away from the Greens. But at the moment, I am absolutely in shock about the way in which they have ignored standards within their own party. Jenny Leong last week said this, sorry, on December last year said this, the Jewish lobby and the Zionist lobby are infiltrating into every single aspect of what is ethnic community groups. Their tentacles reach into the areas that try and influence power, and I think we need to call that out and expose it. It is one of the most blatant, racist and bigoted statements by any elected official in Australia. And I, I, I'm, you know, that's a matter for Ms Leong. But the thing that's really hurtful, Acting Speaker, the thing that really matters is that not one, not one Greens MP, state or federal, has called out and publicly rebuked Ms Leong. Not one. Not one. They all have remained silent in a blatant anti-Semitic statement by one of their colleagues. This conflict in the Middle East is absolutely shattering. It is shattering. I want to see an end to it as soon as humanly possible. I want to see the end to innocent lives lost. I want to see an ability for Palestinians to be able to rebuild their lives in Gaza. I also want to see an ability for Israelis to be able to return to their homes in the southern and northern towns. There is a real terrorist threat that they have faced that we saw on October 7. It is a complicated, deep history, one that we must be mindful of and respectful of when we're talking about this issue. But the way we talk about this in Australia really matters. And to have blatant racism and targeting of a minority community from a major political organisation in this country is just shattering. And I would say to the Greens, be mindful of the way in which you are talking about this issue. Be mindful of the way in which it is impacting a minority people in this country, because that is something that we can control, that we have an ability to make sure Australians feel safe and respected. And right now, Jewish people in Australia don't feel safe and respected by the Greens. I think it's a great shame, and I pray for more peaceful days ahead.